After years of researching, planning and saving, the time has finally come. The animals at the Terre Haute Humane Society have a new home. They outgrew the old shelter, which was built in the 1940s. Before the door opens, though, of the new facility, News 10's Lindsay Yates gets a sneak peek. Same address, brand new look. I still haven't taken my breath yet. We're still trying to get settled in, but it was long overdue and we're thrilled to be here. But shelter manager Fred Strom did take a break to give us a tour. You're looking at the new state-of-the-art Terre Haute Humane Society. This is leaps and bounds bigger than the ones that we had in the other building. And the new building has several unique features for you and the animals. Take, for instance, this cat cafe. You can come and relax and the animals can enjoy your company. Where people can come in and bring their book, their tablet and read or do homework and have Wi-Fi and hang out with cats on some comfortable furniture. For the dogs, bigger and better indoor outdoor kennels. They're guillotine doors. So we pull down on this bone counterweight, the door raises up, the dog gets to go outside. All improvements to make living conditions better for the animals. There's so many things that that building was just fighting us tooth and nail, and now we don't have to worry about them. And Strom believes the new $1.5 million facility will offer something priceless. I could foresee a lot more adoptions, a lot more foot traffic, people really wanting to just come see the animals and not be put off by the facility itself. And there's no shortage of these sweet faces who are searching for their forever homes. We just welcome people to come by and check out the new facility and, and really see kind of the, the crown jewel that we have now to better better get these animals new homes. The shelter will be operational starting tomorrow at noon. In Terre Haute with photojournalist Tony Cassisia, Lindsay Yates, News 10. I would take them all home. Oh. I could never work there. I'd take them all home. I'd take a lot of them home too. <laughs> <laughs> They're adorable. <laughs> the old building will be torn down, by the way. Mm -hmm. As for what they plan to do with the space, no decisions have been made just yet. However, they are looking at options that will benefit the entire community.